Apostle Dr. Faith Walters received the call from the Lord to begin a ministry that would empower individuals for success in the kingdom of God. And Lord God, we thank you for being such a great God. Lift we thank you for being a loving God, a gracious Welcome God. Welcome to Women and Men of Excellence Outreach Ministries. Located in Mount Vernon, New York, and online at wamo.org. Join Apostle Dr. Faith Walters, live on Sundays and Wednesdays at 2 p.m. for divine service, empowerment, worship, prayer, words of encouragement, Bible education, fellowship and more. This broadcast is a production of WAMO Media Network. Thank you for joining us. If you want to support this ministry, please subscribe, like, share this video, and leave a comment. It's easy and will cost you nothing. If you want to donate, please visit www.wamo.org forward slash give. You can watch our services via our website, live.wamoe.org, on television via Carib Vision, at caribvision.tv, and on the YouTube and Facebook apps. You're worthy, Jesus. We exalt you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Blessed be your name. Touch that child, God, that's locked in the room right now. In the name of Jesus, uh, send help from your sanctuary, Jesus. Send help from your sanctuary, God. The child has been abused right now, Jesus. Human traffic right now, God. That child has been kidnapped right now, Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Spirit of God, Jesus. Lord God, go where they are right now in the name of Jesus. So, oh, Spirit of God, Spirit of God, hey, ya la babo, she la baba, siya. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless your name, Jesus. Sala babo, she la baba, siya. In the name of Jesus, touch them right now, Holy Spirit of God. To Shekinah glory. Oh God, hey, yalla baba bo sia. Jesus, you're right there. You're showing up right now in the name of Jesus. Send help, Lord. Send help, Jesus. Hey, la babo sia. Hey, Jesus. A person right now is on the brink of giving up. Oh, Spirit of God. Oh, Spirit of God. About to take their lives. Ah, yalla babo sia. Oh, Spirit of God. Spirit of God. Speak to their atmosphere right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, they have a feeling of hopelessness right now, God. We bind up every plan of the enemy right now, God. Want to come against their mind, Lord God. Come against their spirit, Father. Come against their body in the name of Jesus. Ah, yalla baba sia. Whatever the pain right now that is causing them, Jesus, to feel like all hope is gone. We speak to that one right now in the name of Jesus. All hope is not lost, Jesus. Lord God, given the courage to stand, God, put down that knife, put down that gun. Huh? Yeah, Jesus. Ha, huh, Jesus. We took all them pills, God. Then it bring back up the pills in the name of Jesus. Huh? Jesus. 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 Lucy right now. Lucy right now, Jesus. Loose here right now, Jesus. Loose here right now. Loose here right now. Those are feeling depressed right now, God. Hey, Jesus. Touch that mindset right now in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit of God. Jesus. Jesus. Those are battling blood disorders right now in the name of Jesus. Hey. Jesus. Hey, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. But I pray now in the name of Jesus. 
all type of cancers right now got every type of cancer breast cancer throat cancer liver cancer kidney holy spirit of god prostate cancer ovarian cancer oh spirit of god hey yalla babosia lymph node cancer yalla babosia but of the cancer right now in the name of jesus uh, those are going to chemo lord jesus radiation therapy right now god in the name of jesus restore those cancer cells restore lord jesus not the cancer cell jesus restore the body the normal cell lord jesus destroy god Lord Jesus, destroy those cancer cells, God. Bring healing to the body, Jesus. The good cells, Jesus. Bring it forth, God. In the name of Jesus. Tear down every cancer cell right now, God. Bring healing to the body, Father. In the name of Jesus. Restore those cells, God. In the name of Jesus. Spirit of the living God. On the behalf right now, God. Everybody battling some kind of cancer situation right now, God. Speak to the root, Lord Jesus, of that cancerous situation, God. Heal them right now in the name of Jesus. Heart disease right now. Touch them, Father, in the name of Jesus. Alcoholic Jesus, alcoholic addictions, God, drug addiction, God, from all kind of addiction, Jesus, opioid, everything, heroin, Jesus, marijuana, whatever it is, Jesus, cocaine, Father, PCP, RCP, whatever kind of, whatever kind of drugs, Jesus. We ask you, God, for deliverance right now, Father. Oh, Spirit of God. Spirit of God, Spirit of God. Oh God, set them free today, Jesus. Deliver them, God. God, we pray, God, that you move on their behalf today. In the name of Jesus. Those are gang affiliations right now, God. Hey, yellow bubble. See, release, release, release in the name of Jesus. Lord God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. You're doing it right now, Jesus. You're doing it right now, God. You're doing it right now in the name of Jesus. We are victorious, Jesus. Victorious, Jesus. Hey, we are victorious with more than Congress through Jesus Christ, our Lord, on today, God. Jesus. Go to the root of the pain right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Oh, Spirit of God. Oh, Spirit of God. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Touch your people today, God. Those are dealing with homosexuality, Jesus, transvest, transvestite, transgender, whatever it is, Jesus. We bind up every demonic spirit right now. In the name of Jesus. Every type of spirit, every generational curse. Every curse, God, every demonic force jesus to cause them to want to change the agenda and be part of a homosexual lifestyle speak to the root of the problem right now god uproot god overturn jesus oh spirit of god heal jesus heal jesus Heal the pain of their past, God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. 
speak right now over their bodies, God, over their minds, Jesus, over their spirit, God. The end is not near. I yell about Basia. Still have life left. You restore them, Jesus. They will testify of your goodness. They will testify how you deliver them, Jesus. Pains of their past, God. Pray for that drag queen today, Jesus. Whatever it is that caused him to dress up like that, God. We pray for him today. Hold the Spirit of God. Cross chest dresses, Jesus. Pray for them, God. They need help, Jesus. They need help, Father. They need help, God. They need help, Jesus. Lord Jesus, Holy Spirit. Loose here, Jesus. Loose here. Loose here, Jesus. Loose here. Set the captive free today. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Spirit of God. Hey, la ba bo, say la ba ba shia. Thank you. Oh, bless your name, Jesus. Those are dealing with loss right now, God. Hey, yeah, la ba ba shia. The grief of the loss of a loved one, Lord Jesus. Touch them right now, God. Touch them, Jesus. Lord God, and God through a divorce, Jesus. Lord God, touch them right now. Loss of a job, Lord Jesus. Touch them. Restore to them, Jesus. Let them realize, God, all hope is not God. Give them that faith that continues to stand strong, God. In the meantime, Jesus, increase their faith. Oh, Spirit of God. Bless them be your name. Bless them be your name, Jesus. Bless them be your name. Thank you, Jesus. That your angel, your healing power. Your angels is moving about the atmosphere, Jesus. Touching, healing, delivering, setting the captive free today. In the name of Jesus, blessed be your name. Blessed be your name, Jesus. Blessed be your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. My law enforcement, Jesus. Touch them right now, God. Our judges, Lord Jesus. Let them do the right thing, Father. Oh, God. Our elderly Jesus. Touch them, God. In the name of Jesus. Heal, God. Heal our land, Jesus. Heal our land, God. So much murders. Every day you get up, Jesus. Somebody's murdering somebody. Jesus. The land is gone too far from you, Jesus. Lord God. Our land is lost his first love, Jesus. So much unrest in many countries, God. So much unrest, Jesus. Pray for restoration today, God. Restoration, Jesus. Restoration, God. 
restoration, Jesus. Restoration for your people, Jesus. Restoration, restoration, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for our leaders, God. To tell the truth, Jesus. Tell the truth, Lord God, to the people. So they can be set free, healed, and delivered, Jesus. We pray, God, you raise up more people, Jesus. Will not be afraid to teach and preach the unadulterated word of God. Lord Jesus, teach, make it practical, God, so people can understand, God. We pray, Jesus, that you will touch right now. In the name of Jesus, pray for those that we connect to on in the dome and Third Street, God. Brother Greg, Brother Michael, Brother Solomon, Brother Shanique. Brother David Fitzgerald, Sister Markea Roberts, Sister Marshala Mar 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 Brauna, Brother Andrew Rivera, Brother Orlando Fernandez, Brother Leon, Brother Robert, Sister Holly, Sister Doris Peyton Jackson, Brother Patrick Blunt, Brother Shaw. Oh, bless your name, Jesus. Brother Roland. Sister Janet, Brother Ralph, Sister Jeanette, each Brother Egypt, Brother Richard, speaking those things as though they were. Brother Joseph, Angelo Hernandez, little Zaya, who gave his heart to you on August 28, 2022, on his birthday. And Brother Gerard, his grandfather. Touch him right now, Jesus. Angel. Yeah, Jesus. And the other Joseph, God, touched him, Father. In the name of Jesus. Remember our team, God. The team that supports this ministry behind the scenes, Jesus. Pray for them, Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Thank you for the service, God. Thank you, Jesus. That's everything that's said and done, God. Let it judge you on the glory of your name, that your name will be praised and glorified in the atmosphere, Jesus. Pray for those that could take in communion today, Jesus. Pray that you will cover them right now. And as they take the communion, Jesus. They need healing in their bodies, God. It is so. It is so, Jesus. It is so. It is so, Jesus. I decree and declare healing, God. Healing over this land in the name of Jesus. Hey, Jesus. Healing, God. Healing in our prison system, God. Healing for our children, Jesus. Healing for our marriages, God. Healing, Jesus. For the laws that would come forth and would do the right thing, God. Our laws are so corrupt, Jesus. Healing for their minds, God. They will do the right thing, Father. God, we bind up every plan, God. Even this new robot system, to come back crime in San Francisco, Jesus. We bottle up every diabolical plan. If it's not done for the right reason, Jesus, mash up that robot system in the name of Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Whatever it is, if it's the evil scheme behind it, Jesus. 
March of the bright now in the name of Jesus. If it's not to help to combat crime, Jesus. Destroy it right now in the name of Jesus. Hey, yellow bubbles. God, those information on social media in some of these countries encouraging people to take their lives and doctors encouraging people to take their lives. Doctors are supposed to save lives. The Lord Jesus, whatever country, Lord God, is doing these practices, God. We bind up right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, Spirit of God. Every lying demonic force, God, that want to destroy humans, Jesus, vaccines, whatever they want to use, we bind up right now. I don't know who died, God, that made these people God. And said, who should be on the earth and who should not be? The rich think because they have their money. They want to keep it all to themselves. Don't want to share it. But your word said, rich and his money will soon depart. They soon separate. You said the love of the money, God, is the root of all kind of evil, Jesus. They continue to love their money more than they love you, Jesus. Their soul is wanted today, Jesus. So those are behind all the wicked schemes to try to destroy mankind or wipe them out, whatever which way they're thinking of doing it, God. We leave them in your hand right now, Jesus. Expose, uproot, overturn every secret thing, Lord Jesus. They're trying to shut down everything. I bought it all the babies. Now they, they, they're encouraging uh, 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 little boys and little girls to change the agenda. So as to stop life from coming forth. How dare they? Let me pray today, Jesus. That everything, God, it is not like you, Jesus. You are destroyed it right now in the name of Jesus. Oh, Jesus, power. Supernatural power of the Holy Ghost. Sweep through our towns, sweep through our villages, sweep through our communities, God. Sweep through our states. Sweep through our cities, our towns, our bush, wherever we are, Jesus. All these countries, God. Caves, mountains, wherever they are, Jesus. Sweep through. Shake up the atmosphere, Jesus. Shake it up in the name of Jesus. Spirit of the living God. Go behind closed doors, Jesus. Every secret thing, every chat room that is not right, Jesus. Every floorboard, Jesus. Every secret dungeon, God. Every secret meeting, Jesus. Destroy it right now in the name of Jesus. Every diabolical scheme, God, that is not of you, Jesus. Every backdoor deal, Jesus. Every arms dealer, every opium dealer, every cocaine dealer, every, every, every rebel. Jesus, 
Mash it up, Jesus. Crush it up, Jesus. Break it at the root, at the neck, in the name of Jesus. Everything, God. It's not of you. That's not right, Jesus. Every secret thing, God, is coming into the light in the name of Jesus. Type of force, satanic cults, satanic meetings. Salabo yo, shika salabo mashia. Come into the light, God. Sacrifices, human sacrifices, Jesus. Oh God, you're tearing it down. You're tearing the enemy's kingdom down in the name of Jesus. Will not continue to unleash his eps into the into the atmosphere, trying to destroy people's minds and thoughts and thinking. Oh, Spirit of God, we condemn every type of force. We want to come against your people, God? Pray for mental illness right now, Jesus. Oh God, Jesus. Touch that reuptake in the brain, God. Let it click properly, Father. In the name of Jesus. You're going in, Lord Jesus. Hey, Kalababashia. You're going in, Jesus. Hey. Just say, like Jesus. Cleared out all the money. Changes out of the temple. Oh, Jesus. You're going in and sweeping house, God. In our churches, God. In our homes, God. All the filth. God, deliver your people right now. In the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Say so your guarded angels, God. Protect us from harm and danger, Father. Protect your people. Oh, Spirit of God. Thank you for answered prayer right now, Jesus. Thank you for answered prayer, Jesus. Name of the Father. Name of the Son. Name of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. You're doing it right now, God. You're doing it right now. Somebody deal with unforgiveness. God said to release it. Release it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Forgive. Let it go. If you want your blessings to flow, you got to let it go. Your blessings are held back because you won't let go of the past. Unforgiveness. So I'm holding you back, my sister. I don't know who I'm talking to. But our forgiveness is, is causing a lot of ruckus in your life. God is saying, release the hurt. Release the pain. Whatever it is. Let go and let God have his way in your life. God wants to do some things where you want to bless you abundantly because you're holding on to things. Holding on to past hurts. Oh, Jesus. I can tell you. If I didn't forgive, I wouldn't be where I am today. So stop holding on to the past hurt. The past pain. Release it to God. 
Release it to the Lord. Release it, release it. Release it, release it, release it. Release it. Release it. Release it. Allow God to have his way in your life. I promise you, you let go. You forgive. Let go. See how your life will have a 360 degree turn. Just let go. Let God have his way. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Bless your name, God. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, God. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, Jesus. Bless your name, Jesus. <clears throat> hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless your name, Jesus. First Corinthians 11, verse 23 says, For I received of the Lord, that which also I delivered unto you, the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. When he had given thanks, he broke it. And he said, take, eat. This is my body, which is broken for you. This do remembrance of me. After the same manner also he took the cup. When he had supped, saying, this cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye as often as ye drink it, in remembrance of me. For as often as ye drink, eat this bread, hallelujah, and drink this cup, ye do show the Lord's death till he come. Wheresoever whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily, shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. Let a man examine himself. So let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For you that eat it and drink it unworthily, eat it and drink it damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. For this cause many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. But we would judge ourselves, we should not be judged. And when we are judged, we are chastened of the Lord, that we should not be condemned with the world. Praise the name of Jesus. You're going to be taking communion right now. Please have your bread and your biscuit. That's the name bread, biscuit, or crackers, whatever you have, because it's a symbolism. And you drink either water or juice or wine, whatever your fancy. You're just symbolizing the blood. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And his body. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Touch your people right now, God. Take a moment and ask God to touch your heart. Touch your mind before you take this communion. We won't take it on worthily. It may look simple for some people. But those are in the Lord. We know we don't take this lightly. Because the Lord says as often as we do it. We do it in remembrance of him. 
you may go ahead and take the bread, which represents his body, in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless your name, Jesus. Take his, <coughs> drink the wine or the juice, whatever you have. The liquid that represents his blood that was shed on Calvary for you. Let me take it now. In the name of the Father, name of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Bless your name, Jesus. I just want to welcome everybody here on our platform, our social media, listen to it, the broadcast, wherever you're listening to it. Thank God for you joining in. Praise God for you and you and you. On behalf of uh, Women and Men of Excellence Outreach Ministries, Senior Pastor, your truly Apostle Dr. Faith Walters, so glad to have you to be a part of the service on today. We pray the anointing of God continue to flow in your life as you continue to move forward in him. Hallelujah. And if you have not acknowledged Jesus in your heart, pray that today is the day that you will acknowledge him as Savior and Lord. If you have never given your heart to the Lord, let today be the day. But just say yes to his will. If you are back sin, hallelujah, let today be the day. But just say yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I surrender all to you. So I'm just thankful to you on today. Thank God for my team who's always with me in the background. God bless them. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Very blessed team. They keep me keep me going, keep me on my toes, keep this ministry running, praise God, and they allow God to use them. Even sometimes I don't come in like I'm supposed to, but they work with me, Holy Spirit of God, and I'm just thankful for that. Hallelujah. Thank God for this great team of people that the Lord has put in this, to this, in this ministry to bring it to where it is, and it's going to go further. Holy Spirit of God, may God continue to bless them. Holy Spirit of God, and every uh, uh, um, sector of this ministry, every project, everything that we put forth, hallelujah, God is doing awesome things. Even now, we're moving even higher. We are in the season now of December. This is our first month, and we just thank God for, uh, this is the last month, actually, sorry. This is the last month of the year of 2022. So we're in uh, the 12th month of the year and great things, great things. Praise the Lord, uh, Minister Carter. Thank God to see you here. Praise God. And great things is about to take place. But watch out. Watch God do some things, supernatural things, things that you're waiting on. Hey. You may think God took a, a long time, but trust me, huh, some things had to change within you for it to take place. Bless the name of Jesus. Because God knows, God, don't think God don't know what he's doing. And don't think he's taking too long. I know a lot of y'all think God is taking too long. Hey, there's a reason why he's doing it. Because some of y'all need to do some, some changes of things in your lives. Some of y'all need to really, really get closer to God. Some of y'all need to increase your faith. Some of y'all need to get some faith. <laughs> oh, bless the name of Jesus. But anyway, let me just, let me not start yet, y'all. Oh, Spirit of God, welcome everyone. God bless you. Again, thank you so much for joining into the service. God bless you. Oh, Spirit of God, hallelujah. Yes, I mean, it's a card, it's good. We can laugh, that's right. 
it's okay to laugh sometimes because guess what? When you laugh, <laughs> sometimes you just get up and just have uncontrolled of laughter. You know what that does to the enemy? Oh, he can't stand that because you're laughing at him. Because <laughs> he always loses. <laughs> he always think he wins, but he loses every time. Praise God. Oh my, I like to have fun in the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the name of the Lord. We're going to listen to our testimony from our ministry clip, but uh, it's not able to come forth. But guess what? There's always a testimony. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Apostle Faith always got testimonies. Yes, because God continues to do so much yes and in in spite of everything that goes on i continue to bless god just a, about a month uh probably it's almost a month now it's over a month now i was in a, uh, i was in a car accident a car just ran into me out of nowhere skipped the stop sign and ran into me You know, I really thought, again, I saw my life flash before my eyes, destroyed the whole left side of my vehicle, the whole driver's side to the passenger door. The vehicle was rammed in and that thing messed up my left side. I'm still dealing with pain, but thank God for doctors are working with me. And I still get headaches from time to time, but my left side is a little off balance at times. But you know what I'm grateful to God for? It could have been so serious. And you know, I'm thankful that, you know, a lot of times we, we don't wear we don't wear our seatbelts. And I'm so glad I had the seatbelt on. Cause what I realized if I didn't have that seatbelt on. Mm. Y'all don't want to listen to law sometimes. You think the seatbelt keep you uh, 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 um, uh, uh, can keep you tight or whatever it is. But let me tell you something. I thank God I had that seatbelt on. I have to thank him for that. And I think every time I go in my car, I always put my seatbelt on. Especially in the front seats. When you're in the front seat of your car, when you're in the passenger side or the uh, 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 off the front seat, you always got to wear your seatbelt. Even if you're in a passenger in the back seat, put on your seatbelt. Because I tell you the truth, if I didn't have that seatbelt on, I could have gone through that windshield of that vehicle. But God in his mercies, Give me sense enough to keep wearing that seatbelt. See, God give you common sense. You got to use it. And I'm so glad I'm here. And the aftermath of that accident. I think about the many times I came very close to dying. Came very close to my whole body just messed up. You know, but God, but God, and because I keep speaking the word over my body, I keep speaking the word over my mind. I keep saying to the Lord, I shall not die, but live and proclaim the word of the Lord. The word of God says that his life and death in your tongue. And I continue to breathe life into my body every day. I get up. I continue to speak the word of God. And I thank the Lord that Corona came and went. I never took a vaccine. People been around me that had Corona, but it never come near me. Because I kept praying Psalm 91 over my life. I believe the word of God. I ain't catch no flu either. Flu going in and out. 
I ain't catch none. The last time I caught it was some years ago. And I had nobody there to help me through it. It was the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit that was with me. Helped me through that process. Helped me help myself by making some chicken soup and got some rest. It was just me and the triune God that covered me. So let me say today, I pray somebody is encouraged by my testimony. Declare the word over your life that you will not die, but live and proclaim the works of the Lord. Psalm 118, 17. Pray it over your mind. Pray it over your whole body. Pray that you'll never get memory problems. Pray you'll always remember. You ask God how long you want to live. People keep saying life is short. Life isn't short. Life is what you make it to be. If you ask the Lord for long life, he'll give it to you. It said in the Psalm 91. But long life that satisfy me, show my salvation. But it's up to you. But you got to believe when you speak it. You got to believe it. Sometimes some things happen to men and women of God. And we don't, we can't explain some things. We can't explain why some things, some men and women of God take away just suddenly. Only God knows that. But I ask God for long life. I ask him to give me the strength. In spite of how many times that this right side is messed up, and I've been broken up so many times. Thank God for doctors that put me back together fell down steps. And I remember that today, 18 steps just came in my mind again today as I was praying. Could have fell. I hit my head. I hit every part of my head. I could have had a broken neck, but look at God. And that happened in 2015. I broke my wrist in two places at my shoulder bone. And the way I was rolling down them steps, you think that I broke my neck. Yeah. I just realized it just as I was praying this morning. I said, oh, my God, could have went another way. But God, I'm still standing here. And I'm still proclaiming the name of Jesus. So those who don't know Jesus Christ, I suggest you get to know him in the fullness of his power. He'll take you through so much. And declare the word of God over your life. You will continue to succeed. Praise the name of Jesus. God bless you. Thanks for watching. Please join us next time for the continuation of this episode. Stay tuned. Thank you for staying with us today. We invite you to come back again and join Apostle Faith Live on Sundays at 2 p.m. for Bible education and church services, and Wednesdays at 2 p.m. for Feature Wednesdays, where we share messages from other kingdom leaders from within the WAMO network. Are you a kingdom leader with a message of hope and inspiration for the children of God? Send us an email with your message to support at wamo.org or join the WAMO Media Network via our website, wamo.org forward slash network. Are you in need of prayer? Email prayer requests to support at wamo.org or join our prayer line, Monday mornings at 7 a.m. Lord God, we thank you for being such a great God. We thank you for being a loving God, a gracious God. We worship you, our Lord. You are worthy. If you need help to overcome low self-worth, heal your marriage, restoration through therapy for children, teens, individuals, and couples, book an appointment for therapy with Dr. Faith at our website, wamo.org forward slash counseling. You may also access self-help resources at our website, wamo.org forward slash resources. 
If you would like to become a member, volunteer, or partner with WAMO Outreach Ministries, send your email to support at wamo.org. Come as you are. Why you should join this ministry. 1. To empower people for success in the Kingdom of God through Bible education. 2. To provide support services for the upliftment and development of your community. 3. To empower children and youth to increase their knowledge and earning potential by advancing their skills and professional capacity. 4. To provide solutions for families who need shelter, a place for worship, skills development, and access growth opportunities for community leaders. And 5. To provide support and a source of hope for senior citizens, ex-convicts, and people in need. It's easy to support this ministry, here is how you can help. Through tax-deductible giving, easily accessible everywhere via our website, at wamo.org forward slash give. You can give a one-time or monthly donation, or contribute funding to one of our programs. Become a member of our community or volunteer team, apply at our website, at wamo.org forward slash membership. Become a member of our network, and let us work together, to build and grow a strong, healthy community of Kingdom Advocates, empowering people for success in the Kingdom of God. Sign up at our website, wamo.org forward slash network. Other ways to join us and support the ministry. Subscribe on YouTube at WAMO Ministries, Apostle Faith Live. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram at WAMO Ministries. Contact us anytime at Women and Men of Excellence Outreach Ministries. P.O. Box 2077 Mount Vernon, New York 10551. Telephone 914-699-2482 and email support at WAMO, W-A-M-O-E, dot org. Your support and generosity will positively change lives.